picture right now, struggling to play full 60 minutes, 24 games left. Is the reality starting to set in for this team that you need to start picking it up? I think the reality has been set in. You know, I, I don't, you know, I think we're not, we're not going to look at the big picture right now. We're going to take each game as it comes, and that's the approach that we've always taken with this group is making sure that we control, uh, we stay in the moment, we control what we can to get, to, to get the best results, and, uh, and, that's, and that's all we can do. The reality is, is there's a lot of games left. There's a lot of opportunity for us to, uh, to win games and put ourselves in the best possible position, and that's how we have to look at it. Is it Chris and Goldman? Okay. Casey. Patrick Hornquist has a registered point in 11 games. Is there something that's maybe not clicking with his game right now? Well, I think you know when you, when you look at Horny's overall game, he's at his best when he's uh, when he's in on the four check. He's he's going the net. He's uh, you know he's wreaking havoc with with our opponents with his with his physical play and his and his energy and uh, and that's the type of play, that's the type of player that he is. I thought the last game that he played has, has been one of his best since he's come back off his injury. Um, I think if he does more of the same, then then the results will follow. Mike, what was the thing you noticed with Harry Schultz in the lineup yesterday that um, makes it obvious what he plays? Well, I just think his ability to move the puck. You know, when he goes, he goes back to pucks quickly. He gets, you know, he's a mobile guy. He can really skate. He gets back to pucks. He helps us with our breakouts and, and getting out of our end. He's uh, he's smooth on the offensive blue line. He's got great instincts. He jumps into the right holes at the right time. Uh, you know, to give himself an opportunity. There was a play early in the game when he gets a scoring chance, and the, when he jumps into the slot, that's an indication of what what he brings is is his ability to see the hole and, and jump into it at the right time. Um, you know, to present himself so that so that he can he can create opportunity there for our team, and and I think that's an indication of what he brings. Since Matt got healthy and you know started to sort of play more, um, that means the starts are further between for Casey. How do you think he's handled that with a different workload? I think he's done a pretty good job. You know, in, in most of the games that Casey's been in, he's given us a chance to win. Mike, the decision to pull Matt yesterday was that. Looking to get a spark, were you seeing something in that that you didn't like? Uh, there was a lot that went into it. Um, you know, we talked about it in between periods, and, and we felt like, you know, we needed a spark. We needed, we needed to try to generate some energy, and, um, and sometimes that's the best way to do it. Thanks, Doug. <laughs>